Hey guys, in today's episode I'm going to show you how to set up a uh, ex nihilo silkworm, silk, silk farm, and um, there's a few steps to it. The downside to this technique is kind of it depends a lot on luck. You need to have found a vanilla sapling, and this is the place you find them. It's going to be in one of these roguelike dungeons on the first layer. Um, if you're having trouble finding one, if you find one of these you're pretty much guaranteed to find a a swarm spider spawner so it might be um, easier to just build a, a spider spawner but if you get lucky I'll show you what you're looking for okay so you make it to the first floor like this uh, if I can remember where this thing was you're looking for these rooms that have kind of doors on them um, if you go in sometimes you'll find flower pots with vanilla saplings in them so this is dark oak which is fine should work except that you need four of those saplings to be able to grow a tree uh, so that's a bit of a nightmare. Um, there's another one right here, and this is a jungle sapling in it. Uh, if I... is this gonna... yeah, there we go. So we got our jungle sapling. So if you make it out of the, the dungeon, obviously you're gonna go back out the front door, but we're doing this for, for speed's sake. There we go, we're out. You should be able to just plant these like any other sapling. Okay, and then you just need to wait for it to grow. Or in our case, we're going to use some bone meal. Because I can cheat it in, because I'm in creative mode. So you get your, your tree like this. The next thing you're going to need is a silkworm. Now, the way you get these is by using a crook on any tree, even uh, terra firma craft trees will work and they're just made with four sticks put in like a crook shape like this if you take one of these and start beating on in fact let's go into survival and i'll show you that this works you can actually use these if you're trying to get more saplings they work for that as well which is pretty good but yeah just beat on your your leaves like this and eventually you will get a silkworm So yeah, keep going on that till you get your silkworm. And then all you need to do, just like if you've ever played any kind of skyblock, uh, of course I picked a tall tree here. Right click on one of the leaves, and you can see it says infested leaves. Now you can infest the leaves of these TFC trees. Um, I just tested it out because a lot of people were saying they were having trouble uh, with this um, in, the, in the forums. And yeah, I let this infest and the, and the leaf actually just disappears. It doesn't keep infesting the rest of the tree. Whereas with our jungle tree, it has spread to all the leaves like, a, like it would normally, right? So if we go back into survival, and just start beating on these leaves, you start to get string. And that is literally all there is to it. So the hard part with this is just finding the sapling in the first place. And after that, after that you're good to go. Uh, so I hope that was useful for, for some people. Um, let me know if there's anything else you'd like me to cover. Otherwise, I will see you later. Bye bye